Now, widowhood in most Nigerian societies has been characterized by numerous challenges, including abandonment by in-laws to raising children alone, social exclusion, economic hardship, and violence. These challenges have multifaceted effects, which often prevent many of them from fulfilling their dreams and maximizing their full potential. In this report, our correspondent Habila Durafai finds out how Catherine Dunia survived the arts of widowhood. 66-year-old Catherine Dunia has survived the challenges characterized by widowhood for 30 years. Her late husband, Beatrice Dunia, who was a member of the Kaduna State House of Assembly between 1979 to 1981, died in 1993 following wrong drug prescription and administration. Against all odds, she has become widowed through resilience and commitment by working hard in farms to raise five children all by herself, despite pressures to remarry. Looking back in the past 30 years, all she could do is to thank God. I make up my mind to say, I am not going to be lazy. I have to get up, look for money, send my children to school, feed them. Because at that tender age, if I said I want to go and marry, I had five children already. Who am I going to leave those children with? Leaving them with people who turn them to be house help. They eat and remain and give them. Some places, even when they eat and remain, they will not give them. But they want them to do the housework. So because I do not want my children to suffer. They are his children, they are my children. Today, I am enjoying the benefit of my hard work. It's not there to enjoy with me. She advises other widows to look beyond their challenges in order to withstand their plights. Catherine believes they should see themselves as equals in the society. So my advice the younger widows, stop pitying yourself and look for sympathy from people. You are just like any other woman, whether she has a husband or she does not have a husband. Determination, be determined. If others can make it, I can equally make it. I used to farm very well, farm up to seven hectares, ten hectares and the insecurity. Because I cannot go far now, that's why I have decided to bring my farm to the house. Planted cassava, I planted the yams. So from time to time, when it is the time, I can just remove and cook and give to them. Catherine believes that if she could survive 30 agonizing years of widowhood, others going through similar situations can also succeed with focus and determination. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.